hello and welcome to free.net tutorials this is Emmanuel Mendu in this video we will see uh, how to use some methods like uh, in this video we will see how to use execute reader with small example as, as we see in our examples example videos you see uh, adio.net is using execute reader execute scalar and execute non squaring first of all if you want to read or if you want to retrieve some data from backend you need to use execute reader and execute scalar whereas execute scale non query is used to uh, update edit so to edit insert or any changes you want to do in database you need to do take execute non query so let's uh, see with an example how we use execute reader like new website using C sharp and uh, what I'm doing is I'm using this login table in our Mendo database if I if I give 500 I need to get username and password so let's see how it how it goes now like uh, I want to go to the toolbox I need one test box and two labels to get uh, our username and password. And I click on button. I need to get like get so you. Uh, username where pass word is okay so what I'll do is First, I'll put these names as like unknown. When I click on button, when I give that ID value, I need to get these names and password into that field. So let's double click on the and you see a button click event, and let's write. A namespace to use our uh, SQL client or SQL server. So we need to instantiate uh, SQL connection. So let's go to our server explorer. Let's get connection string okay and uh, initialize equal command and the SQL data reader also okay so let's open our connection here inside or button click and our SQL command SQL command like select username password username comma password is it right from let's see here from login where what is it's capital id equal to
and this is a sing so we need to keep single quote also need to close the command and the connection is con so after giving that uh, sql command data reader equal to command dot execute reader see when you are putting some dot to our command you see data execute non query execute reader and execute failure even you see execute xml reader also we'll see that example in our uh, next videos now let's see execute reader when i put this whatever the content like whatever whatever we are writing here it stores in our reader data reader using this execute reader command method okay so we need to move next using read method and what will do is let label one dot text equal to zero dot to string see this is our username it stores the username and we got our password also it uh, it is like um, a memory location of 0 and 1 if you are t if you are selecting username and password this is 0th location stores username and once first location stores the password and after that close the connection and uh, build your project let's run it so let's see before like what's going on back end like uh, find out one let's queue find out one if i put on get your username is mrudil and your password is one for you okay that you see in the same thing in our back end also let's queue five or two you see your username or username is emo and your password is one two three four five that's it uh, we will see uh, further like execute scalar and execute non query in our uh, next videos watch all my videos on desibindas.com and please be free to comment on my videos see you in the next video bye bye